Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah by Rashford being in an offside position, how that has not impacted when a Kanji, City When a Kanji, players. Chris, first plays him off, he steps, he steps into the line to play him off. So there's, there's, the, there's the indication that he has had an impact, Marcus Rashford, on a Kanji, because he's stepped to play him offside. Just a point on that. Two years ago, we went back to the default position of saying to players, play to the whistle. That's not a so law. Don't, it's not a no, law. it's not a law, but because of AR, just, just play to the whistle as you were always taught when you first started playing football. Because he's clean through, he doesn't play the ball. And when, when you talk he's about line up, line up, well, he, he's only running, the ball is in front of him. But I think Leon makes a great point. If Marcus Rashford puts his hands up and either stops dead in his tracks or makes a run away from the ball, then you go, ah, that's legal because Bruno Fernandes has made an amazing run. But the fact that he's shepping in the ball and the Kanji's behind him, so then the defender can't get there, then take into account Edison and what he's thinking and what he sees. Yeah. I think I think forget a Kanji. I, I, I mean, that's Don's opinion because, yes, he's tried to play it offside, but we all know the law's different and Bruno could come in. But the goalkeeper definitely, and Kyle Walker definitely, are impacted by Rashford. Kyle Walker would, would tackle Bruno Fernandes, or at least attempt to tackle him. He doesn't. He runs away because he thinks that Marcus Rashford yeah. has got it. I hear what you're saying, and I don't think we've, we've really seen one of these before in the Premier League. I mean, it's, it's a really complex decision. Um, are people comfortable with it? Obviously not, but they've got to make a decision on field. And, you know, you've, you've got the best, one of the best in the world, you know, Darren Can, Stuart Atwell, top referees, Michael Oliver, of course, who's just been to the World Cup, and they, they make that decision. But when it talks about the goalkeeper playing, the ball doesn't move. The goalkeeper's view is the ball. And it doesn't prevent so, him from so, playing so the ball. Do you think in the coming days, weeks, Howard Webb, PG, MOL, might, I mean, listen, you've not got crystal ball, you don't know, but it's, it's one of them laws where you think this can't be right. Will they say they got will it they right? Say, in their meeting tomorrow, will they say they got it right? Or will they look at that and go, actually, we should have disallowed it? Well, what will happen is they've got a meeting tomorrow and then on Thursday, the Premier League review panel meet, which is somebody from the Premier League, the PGMOL, and three former uh, Premier League players. So they, they will look at that as well. Um, no, I don't think they will. Uh, I think it, it's, the, it's the law. I, you know, I've said that from the beginning. Mm. Um, are we comfortable with it? Probably not. But we've had these discussions before, Dan. We've mm. talked about handball, you know, yeah. two seasons ago. We've gone, well, that doesn't feel right. That doesn't sit right. That doesn't look right. And there's been changes. It, it's just an incident that's happened this weekend. It, it's a big talking point. I haven't had much of a weekend. Slightly no. different. <laughs> slightly different. Um, but we had the most different. Salah one the week before. Yes, yeah, yeah. And, and that different. was one in the cup where the, the, the sort of Mo Salah's in an offside position. The ball's flicked, skims mm. off the head, goes to Mo Salah, goal scored. We're talking about offside. Um, it might be one of those because it doesn't smell quite no, right. No, like the Mo Salah. Mm. That maybe the lawmakers actually have to have another yet another. I think that's think the biggest indication. That one. Offside. If you are going to have a think about the offside, and that one probably comes around once every whatever it is five yeah. ten years. That's the one where I think there will be some sort of law, in my humble opinion, in the future where you go, if that happens again, that's offside. Yeah.